Hello Twin Flames and welcome to the quick five minute check in for Thursday. So what's the question we need to be asking today? Let's have a look. We've got energy around Twin Flames and separation. So we're very aware right now that separation is coming to an end. The things are changing. I'm going to use the Twin Flame message tarot for this. The things are falling into place and you're going to be feeling that. And obviously that separation is where the healing occurs and all the preparation takes place. So what do we need to know about it? First of all, we've got you will achieve success. So the separation brings in success. It says, remember who helped you get there and stay grateful. So remember that your twin is helping you to achieve union. So stay grateful. People around you are teachers to you. So stay grateful. So this is reminding you during the separation to release any bitterness or resentment or, you know, struggle around what's going on because everything is moving you forward to union. So I'm actually seeing everything you're going through and everyone who you're encountering, whether it's a karmic partner or something else, is a stepping stone or a helping hand to your union. So you're being guided to be grateful. We've got the Six of Cups. Bless the past because the best is yet to come. Now, this is also a card of reunion. So the best is yet to come. Everything before union, including separation, is a dress rehearsal. You together in union, permanent union, is the grand show, the grand finale, the end result. So think about how we have to prepare. You know, if there's a theatre production, the cast have to prepare and make it right so that when the curtain goes up it's the best it can possibly be and that's what I'm feeling here so bless the past bless the separation bless everything because the best is yet to come and the four of swords a time of reflection and healing so the energy around separation is always a time to heal and to reflect and think and process and work things out a time where you mirror each other's energy which means you feel what they're feeling. You go through what they are going through. You experience things on a deep level. And you also learn to go with the flow. So the divine feminine here is realizing that fear is illusion. It's only real in the mind. We have the sun. We realize in separation that you deserve the happiness. You deserve all the happiness you're asking for. When we ask, it will be given. So the separation is where we learn and understand what this journey is so we can move forward towards a positive outcome. And the Eight of Swords is the key. The mind can be a prison. You hold the key to your own freedom. So in the separation, it's where all the things that need to go are released. We turn the key towards a new future. We release karmic endings. We release things that need to go. Codependent behavior, stress, anxiety addictions, pain, suffering, negativity, fear, all the things that cause pain. We let go of them and open the door to a new beginning and also a completion. Separation allows us to rise up like a phoenix from the ashes because you were born to shine. So separation is also where we find our truth and we work on service and mission. And we realize who we are. So the energy around twin flames and separation right now is that there's about to be a new beginning. There's a completion phase here. And I'm seeing this as the end of separation. To open the door to a new beginning. To bring in a better future. To open up to that reconciliation so you can talk and heal and balance the past. And never forget who helped you get there because you will achieve success. And everything and everyone is a helping hand or a stepping stone to your future. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.